Homesickness. What is homesickness? Studies show homesickness is one of the top 10 reasons people drop out of university. But what does it actually mean? Is it a feeling we can define? Something specific? And if it's something we feel, what can we do about it? Surely we've all experienced homesickness at some point in our lives, maybe without even knowing it. If that's the case, is there really no place like home? Uh, my name is Nathan and I study film at Solent University. Uh, I'm originally from Milton Keynes and I now live in Southampton. Well, I came here to study at university. I uh, applied for a few places, uh, but Southampton seemed like the best out of all of them. Uh, right now, I live in Southampton in a house uh, shared with four other people, uh, all of which are at university right now. The people I'm living with are studying film, film and TV production, uh, music and event management. Since coming here I've met so many different people uh, from like so many different backgrounds, different countries, cultures. And it's just been nice to get to know uh, new and you know interesting people. So where I go to socialise in Southampton, uh, I normally go to places like pubs, bars, uh, go on a lot of nights out. Spend a lot of like too much money <laughs> on alcohol. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much the main places. To be honest, when you're living with people um, that you enjoy living with, it does feel like a home anyway. So it's nice to live with people that you get on with. And it's nice to have a change away from like living with your parents as well. Mi mancate molto. Io qui mi trovo bene, ho molti amici ed esco spesso. Ho lezione ogni giorno e i miei insegnanti sono molto competenti. Uh, hi, I'm Steph, I'm 20 years old and I study in Southampton Solent University. I uh, come from Italy and Russia. My dad is from Italy, more precisely from Milan, and my mom is from Russia. St. Petersburg. I live in Southampton in um, a residence and um, I live with uh, two other flatmates. In my free time I usually walk around the city, um, go pubs, go clubs or just um, find some activities to do with my friends. I miss a lot of people from home, I miss my friends and my, my parents, I miss um, doing stuff with them and enjoying the time with them. I had quite a few challenges um, since moving. Um, first of all, of course, being away from home and not being close to friends and family um, and I think that's the main challenge. So we're in the library right now and uh, I come here to like to do work and stuff. Uh, they have like loads of books that are really helpful. Uh, but, like, I study film and for the course they have a whole section dedicated to media and film. Uh, so if I ever need to find a certain book I just log on to the website, uh, type in the book I'm looking for and it tells me where I can find it here. I've, I find that coming here is, is very, it's very good for concentration. Um, I like studying at home as well, um, but I also like coming here because you have everything you need. Um, everyone's in the same boat, everyone's studying and trying to get their work done. I started to feel homesick, you know, I, I did start to miss my family, my, you know, my pet, my dog. Um, you know, I love my dog, so it was like really hard to leave her. And it's, it's always really weird coming back to see her you know, after like five or six months.
To combat homesickness, I think a good thing to do for me personally uh, is to just go for a walk in the park. Um, might sound a bit weird, but you know I like having like my own space. Kind of like it helps me just concentrate and relax. You know, it's just good to just go for a walk because you're not thinking about anything. Um, it's nice to like sit down in the park as well, you know, because it just it just helps. <laughs>